Ladies and gentlemen, it's Keith from My Repair Autos. Today I'm going to show you how to replace your nozzle connection points. These are little plastic pieces that connect the hoses that run from your windshield wiper reservoir to the pump up to the sprays for your windshield. These things get brittle, cracked, and disconnect, especially if you live in cold climates. And when they do, the water ends up coming through the vents going in the wrong direction, spraying way up in the sky with missing your windshield wiper oh, oh. entirely. So let's get to it. Don't forget to subscribe ladies and gentlemen. Thanks. Let me show you what's going on here with the windshield wipers. See that? I don't know if you can see that. But it's shooting liquid out from there. So something is wrong. Let's investigate. This could be an easy fix. Might not be. We'll find out though. So there's a shroud right here that we got to remove. It has some tabs right there. And it has like a number. It has a Torx right there. So let's get to it. So I'm going to be taking these off. Just to get back in here. Plastic shroud. There's another one right here. what right there so let's see if that's leaking yep it's still leaking okay so it's removed and uh, this is what the hose looks like And as we've previously seen, the bad section is right here. So after going to the Mercedes dealership and trying to find those hose connections, they told me that they didn't have any. So I went to the local car store and got all these various fittings and we'll find out which one is good for the hose that we have in place. I'll have this part number in the description below. So I'm going to just pop this off right here like this. And the damage right here is this crack right here. So I'm going to take a needle nose pliers. And I'm just going to, without damaging this, even though I'm replacing it, And there we go, we'll pop that off. Using this vacuum hose right here, we're gonna connect it up like that. Push it all the way in. Let's give this a try. Squeeze it. Great. Operating as it should. So we're gonna put back the shroud. What we do is we put the clips back in place first. The clips will hold it in place. Clip right here, press the clip in place. Press this clip in place. Always ladies and gentlemen with the hood closed. It's working again. So that's easy peasy done. As always everyone, don't forget to like, share, subscribe to my channel if you find these videos helpful. What that does, it pushes my videos up in the search results so that other Mercedes owners, drivers, do-it-yourselfers can find them easier. Thanks and peace out. Don't forget to subscribe, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks.